Hey, everybody, it's Dr. Mo from AMH Chiropractic. We're always trying to create a new normal. As you can see, I'm gonna take you through the process of what your visit would look like through the adjustments. First, we have this table that comes up and down like so. That way, if you're in excruciating pain, you don't have to climb on and get off this table, which is fantastic for people that are in pain that have a hard time getting up and down. Then we come down to the feet level and we start checking what's going on with the legs and leg length equality or not. Obviously, you could tell that she has one leg shorter than the other, and that's where we start checking where the muscle spasms are, muscle fatigue are, and we start checking where with edema, and this is all after an exam was taken place the day before, typically. A little bit of tenderness right there? Yeah. Now what happens is the table comes up. When the table comes up, we're gonna end up putting our hands here and here to make it to make it drop down. It's a recoil process, actually fixing the bone where it goes down and comes back up, causing the ligament to sort of release, and we're guiding it with our hands where we want to put it. The table makes a loud noise, like so. It's not the bones that are cracking or popping or doing anything like that. That's actually the table making that noise. You okay there? Yeah. Pressure all right with you? Yeah. So as we're doing this, we're actually shifting the bone rotating our hands, making sure that we're putting enough torque in there to remove the pressure from the joint and remove the, pre remove the edema and some inflammation in there. Take a deep, deep, deep breath in. Hold it. Very good. Do me a favor, take a deep breath in again. Let it go. All the way out. Very good. Relax these shoulders, let it all fall here, good. Take a deep, deep, deep breath in. Let it go. Good. I'm gonna try to work on this curve because we've seen x-rays of, of Nama here. We know that she's sort of got a straight neck going on in, in her neck uh, where the curvature of her spine actually went straight instead of being curved out the way that it should be. So what we're gonna do is a couple different exercises for that. This is one of them. Let's go ahead and look up for me. Good, back down, look up again, all the way up. Good, back down, up again, good, back down. That little bit of motion right there is gonna actually retrain this straight neck to actually become curved after a while, okay? Good, let's have you flip over on your back for me. So what I'm feeling for is that I'm actually feeling for these bones that are actually rotated. And when I feel these bones rotate, I give them a little bit of joint play to see if I can feel them bouncing back and forth from each hand. When I press on this side, I feel it on the right. When I press on this side, I don't feel it on the left, which means that that bone is now stuck. What we're trying to do is make it unstuck. Good. Same thing right up in here. When I'm up in here in this region, I'm actually feeling to see if anybody gets any headaches, uh, TMJ problems, it's all up here or right in here in the jaw. So that's, and, and I know that's one thing Nama has, so I know to go in that area as well. Relaxing. Very good. Good. So what you just seen there so far was just one visit, one chiropractic adjustment visit with me on a regular basis. Now to give you a quick behind the scenes or what I want to do or what I'm looking for. Using the spine here, what we're truthfully looking for is we're looking for bones that are out of place, misaligned. So when they move out of place, what happens is they're pinching the bones, the nerves on this side and on the other side, they're pinching both nerves. So what we do is, and what we're feeling for is when Nama was face down here, we're checking to see where these bones are shifted. Okay, where I feel a larger gap or where I feel one side's higher than the other, because that's gonna cause higher musculature or spasm in that muscle. So when that happens, we know that, hey, that bone is now stuck in this position. We need to contact it and move it back midline, removing the pressure from the nerves. Biggest thing that chiropractors do, we stop the nervous system from having the interference. We stop the traffic jams in the nervous system per se, okay? And that's what you want. You gotta think about a six lane highway in California. One single person gets pulled over and all of us are nice and nosy and we wanna know what's going on and we start looking over our shoulders to see what's going on. That's gonna tap on your brakes, cause a backup of, of traffic, cause interference to happen on that highway. Same thing in your spine. One little bone moves out of place. Now the traffic's not going from the toes to the brain, brain back down to the toes, causing an interference, causing a jamming in the spine. Thank you guys, this is Dr. Mo. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, don't hesitate to give us a call, 313-769-5354, or my Livonia office, 736-2000.
334-525-0200. Our next one would be about either sciatica, headaches, whatever you guys want, let us know, throw it in the comments. We'll get it going for you guys. Thank you guys. Thank you.